it's Richard Bauer here, Yamaha Brand Ambassador at Rivers Music in Edinburgh. Today we're going to answer a question that we're probably asked more than anything about uh, CVP clavinovas. Now CVP is clavinova versatile piano. The versatility comes from the styles. CVP clavinovas have styles. CLP, our classical pianos, don't have styles. So the question is, what is a style? Let's take a look at a very simple piano piece. Let's just play that through on piano and then let's see how we can change that arrangement slightly and play it with styles. So, a nice little piano piece there. First thing that we need to do to play with styles is to have a look at the arpeggios that we were playing in the left hand. Now, basically, when you play with styles, it, the, the arrangement doesn't affect the right hand really at all. But it will change the way that you play your left hand ever so slightly. So let's take a look, first of all, at the arpeggios that we played in that piano piece. And all very lovely. Let's now take those arpeggios and instead of playing them in individual notes, let's play all three notes together. So effectively, we're playing a chord based on the arpeggios that we played in the piano piece. To give room for our right hand to, to, to move around a little bit more on the instrument, we'll play those chords an octave down from where you normally would have played the arpeggios. So we're taking the three notes from each of the arpeggios, playing them together and playing them an octave lower than where you would normally play them on the piano. And, and there we go. Um, doesn't sound very nice, does it? <laughs> and, and rightly so, you're probably thinking at this point, well, that sounds horrible. Well, yes, it does. Because normally you wouldn't play a chord as low as that just on piano. But when we play with a style, something magical happens. So let's now turn on the style and play those same chords again. Isn't that lovely? Now, one of the things that gives you such an advantage when you play with styles um, to, to have much more fun 
and to also to experiment much more musicality um, is the fact that we can add notes. If you add, the, add extra notes into the chords that you play with a style, you can hear lots more fun textures and sounds and different flavours coming off the chords uh, in a way that you wouldn't be able to do on, on just on piano. It would just become a horrible muddy mess if you played four notes together or five notes together. But on styles, because it's orchestrated so beautifully with strings and with guitars and with um, brushes and a bass note, the band will follow the notes that you play and that gives you much more creativity, much more versatility to have lots of fun creating your own chords, creating your own harmonies and to add musicality that's, that's really nice. So now we've had a little practice and, and added a few notes to, to each of the chords and, 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 and some of those notes will work and some of them won't. Um, it's, it's always a little trial and error and it's lots of fun to do that, find out which ones work, which ones don't. Once you've made your arrangement using the style, then we can add the right hand in and now let's have a listen to the whole thing together. Hope you've enjoyed this brief look at using styles they're, they're not scary you hopefully have seen this now as a piano player using styles is not scary it's just a matter of changing the way that you think about your left hand just a little just a little different technique opens up this this incredible palette of musicality and fun and versatility so let's take a listen one more time to the whole thing put together and as always we'll follow this up with looking at styles more in depth and what you can do with them. In the meanwhile enjoy your music and we'll see you soon.